So this guy is, you know, a tweak on drugs, stealing every night. Someone you don't take very lightly. He's spun out every time I've seen him. Go, 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 go. Right. Surround it, guys. Check for a gun. You don't show up in five minutes. You better run to Mexico. You got that? Now! I like that right there. Down a little bit, a little bit more. Perfect. We remodeled the entire office. Leland painted it. I laid the carpet. We redid the front. Basically, we just did a whole makeover. It was time. OK, we're going to look outside. Let me see right now. Yeah, that looks nicer, huh? I like that, the row. Oh, I like the parrot, yeah, too. Beautiful. Yeah, I like the jungle scene like that. It's good, huh? Hi, how's it, little brother? Aloha. Hi. How are you, bro? Is that your dad? She's in there. Auntie Beth is in there. Auntie Beth, the mean one, huh? Not. Where's Uncle Dog at, though? Yeah. He's the boss, huh? Uncle Dog is not the boss. Yeah. Say, who the boss? No. Yeah. No. Yeah. Not yeah. Auntie Give Beth. Me yeah, the bye. Bye. Yeah, that's a good boy. Oh, thank you, brother. OK, bye, you guys. Bye. This is the guy we're going after now. It's a uh, revocation, Leo Souza. Someone you don't take very lightly. He's spun out every time I've seen him come to the office. OK, listen. First one we're going after is Leo Souza. What's his physical, Dwayne Lee? 5'10", 180. OK, 5'10", 180. What's his charges? Promotion of a dangerous drug in the third degree and then drug paraphernalia. Bond is how much? 20,000. 20,000 for possession, controlled substance, uh, methamphetamine, and a pipe. The girlfriend, who is the co-signer, wants off the bond. She said that he is getting high again. He threw a chair out his picture window. I mean, he's just running amok. So as always, aggressive until they're subdued. A couple guys that I've talked to in the last couple days have seen him. He says he looks exactly like the picture. Tall, skinny guy, fighter, you know, his whole life. Leo was convicted years ago, did five years in Halava prison, has been in and out for speed, methamphetamine, drugs, car theft. So we're not going after Peter Pan right here. This guy could get dangerous, could get physical, could get crazy. Do we have an address on him? Yeah. Let's drop up. Let's go get him. Anybody that's been to the penitentiary has a lot of experience in catch me if you can. As soon as he knows we're looking, he'll go under, he'll arm himself, he'll leave the island. So we need to be prepared and ready. The batteries are good. OK, so what happened now? Tell me what happened. The mom just called you and said that his place got raided and he got locked up. OK, let me get dog. All right, hold on. Is that Leo? Yeah, the girlfriend. They just raided his house and busted him. Is he in jail? He's in jail. They got raided this morning. No. I'm sorry, my baby. Another stolen bounty. No way. So call your jail, see if he's there. Hi, sir. This is uh, Dwayne Leo to Kind Bell Bonds. Do you have a Leo Souza? Uh, hold on, let me check. Uh, uh, yes, we do. All right, thank you, sir. I don't know what to tell you now. We got all hyped up, ready to go. Our adrenaline started to flow a little bit, and then all of a sudden, oh, never mind. Just teasing. 
So the cops raided the house, caught him, allegedly with some other stuff, drugs related in the house, with other people there. So maybe it's all for the best that Big Brother took him out instead of us. You just have to take deep breaths and then, you know, on to the next guy. Okay, what do we got? John Albero. You got anything on him? Well, the co-signer called and said that this guy's been running amok. He doesn't think he's gonna go to court. Uh huh. And he's messed around with some other people that he shouldn't be, so he wants to revoke the bomb. All right, let's put him on the board. John Albero, right? So we got a full-blown revocation. You know, right off the bat, looking at the mugshot, he's a runner. How old is he, Leland? 42. Physical, right, Leland? He's 5'7", 150. What is the charge on him? Promotion of dangerous drug, third, two counts. OK, what else we got? The co-signer said that at night, John's stealing all kinds of stuff. And then in the morning, he goes to a place like a swap meet or something and sells it. And then during the afternoon, he's all on the run, different places. And so do we have an address on Johnny Boy? Yes. Where is that at? Waimanalo? Yeah, Waimanalo. OK, let's call one of the numbers to see if he's around. Here's, here's the call center right here. Bonding at the office, where you at? Says he's walking down the street with him. We're walking toward the photo here. Oh, you are? He's got him right now walking down the street. All right, hurry. It's going to take us a while to get there, so get ready right now. OK, let's go. Let's go, Beth. You got the file? Yeah, we got the file. OK, let's dig out. Hurry up, double time. Let's go. When he came to the office, you could tell this John guy was just real sketchy character. So right away, you know, we put this file, you know, with a red flag on it. Watch this guy, watch this guy. This guy is a tweak on drugs. He's allegedly stealing every night. Getting him off the streets is going to make a lot of people safer. It's a little bit urgent since it's kind of on the other side of the island and we've got a long way to go in a short time, so we got to kick it. OK, we're calling the co-signer here, so here we go. OK, he didn't answer yet. No answer. Find the polo field. It's going to be spot him. These are the polo fields right here on the right. Oh, yeah. 4 Here we go, guys. OK, watch really good. Guy's walking with the guy. There's no door. There's no house to kick in. Hopefully, there's not a bunch of guns around. OK, keep your eyes open, everybody. OK, hold on. Here he is. Here he is. On the side street by McDonald's, behind McDonald's? OK, duck down in your car and see if you see him walking down the side street by the McDonald's. 10 4. Who's these two cats right here? OK, who's that? Let's find him. He's in this vicinity right now, you guys. Let's don't lose him. 10 4, checking it out. There's just somebody walking straight down this, in the middle street. Like. Is, that, yep. is that him? Is that guy pointing? Oh, yeah. Um, OK, I think that the co-signer is showing us in his truck. Well, we're on our way. He's in the passenger seat of this truck. He's in the guy's truck. OK, where's the truck at? What color? Tell me. Come on, come on, come on. The blue Toyota truck. OK, don't take him without us. We're coming right now. OK, you guys, heads up, because this could get hairy. Go, 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 go. Go, go, go. You got cops on you, right? Check his gun. Check for a gun. Be safe. Leland, be careful. Surround it, guys. Who's inside here? Freeze! OK, you guys, heads up, because this could get hairy. Okay, go, 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 go. Come on. Go, go, go. You got cuffs on you, right? 
Check his gun. Check for a gun. Be safe. Leland, be careful. Surround it, guys. Who's inside here? So let's go now. Keep your hands where I can see them. You got that? Get him, Leland. I got him. We got him. Right there, right there. John, don't pull nothing out. Let me see that other hand at all times, OK? Here, OK. I'll put it in front of you, John, OK? You're hooked up, are you? What you got on you? Anything. In your pockets at all. You're sure? Positive. OK, let's go now. OK, let them search you, OK? You sure there's nothing in there? Search him, Leland. You got him? Where? Hold on. OK, now don't run, because we'll catch you, all right? OK, who's got leg irons? I got them. Secure him, Leland. All right, let's put him in a vehicle. Come on. Slide right to the middle. Has he got a shirt in here? Seat belt yet. Okay. The cosigner wants this guy off the streets and get him cleaned up for a little bit, you know? When I first met him, he was a decent guy. But now he's out here and he's got the same problem again, so he needs to be locked up for a little bit. Take a second look at life. OK, ready? OK, let's dig out. What have you been arrested for? Trafficking and... Trafficking? Yeah. Are you high right now? Not at all. None? No. Let me see. Oh, well, yes, you are. This tired. Your eyeballs are little, tiny. So if they piss you, you're clean right now? Mm -hmm. Are you hooked bad on the crap? The truth. Yeah. Is no. it like a cigarette? You got to have it? Not really. Not really. So that means almost... Doing it? No, probably 15 years. So it's going to be hard for you to kick this crap then. I mean, it's probably do you, because well, if, it's, if it's a if it's a must, you know what I mean. And yeah, you I must. Have to work. That's I it. Work with that, you know. What I mean? You have any kids? Yeah. So I know that you when you. You must, you know, being a father, you must say, I'm going to do this pipe until I get caught, I die, I what? And if you don't think of nothing, then automatically you're thinking, I'm going to do this till I get caught. So you got caught now, so now you can quit doing it and go back to being a dad. There's any way I could get another chance, like, you know, for get release and stuff and I promise you, I'll try my best to find the kind, keep the habit. I can recommend rehab in the next two days. Okay. But you got to stay in it, because then if you run, then yeah. they're going to call me up and say, hey, dog, your, your new brother just ran. Go get him. But you've never been to rehab at all? No. So see, I think you'd like it. Because then if you're, if you're like that, how old are you, 42? 41. So you're, what, 145 right now, 135? You'd be 190, bro, in a month. If at your age, you'll see, at your age right now, I know, I'm there, that you eat a couple sandwiches, you see it quick in your gut, <laughs> right? Yeah. All of a sudden, you start putting on weight. You're like, what's going on here? What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> sure. If you get anything out of the ride, except for I am your brother, OK? The second thing is that I gotta quit the crap. I got, I cannot smoke it. This is like a warning, bro. A shot over the bow. This is what you're getting, is a shot over the bow. Just like, a warning. You want a cigarette? Okay, what's up? I get some dope that I own you. Right here? Right. I mean, I like, I like doing get up before I get in there, you know what I mean? Give it here, and I'll okay. get rid of it. Super soft. Okay, you're going over there. Okay. Right. Dump that shit out, dude. Hi, the kind bell bonds with discharge of surety. Okay, I'm gonna know. Thank you. 15 years of chronic. 15 years. Sometimes we're like, this is the end of the line. This is a shake you get awake, you're going to prison. 
So he got his chance right now. He needs to take advantage. And I hope he remembers this day. Okay, the guy's in jail. We're gonna say a prayer right here. Lord, thank you very much for the opportunity you've given us to change lives again. We will not let you down. In Jesus' name, amen. Now. Why you got my finger like that? Tell him, Dwayne Lee. We're sitting in the truck. He goes, Dwayne. I go, yeah. He goes, I got something you got to get out of my sock. Pulled out over a half ounce of dough. In his sock. Yeah, so, in his feet right there. But listen, who searched him, son? When you put the leg irons on him, you search his sock before you click him on. I didn't. I take off the and that's, feet. Or you say it again. I, I didn't. Read, I didn't. And so I will next. Next time I'll do that. OK. You promise? Yeah. OK, let's go get another one. Okay. Where's my leg irons at? <laughs> he took them in there with him. Yeah, whatever. So we got the new fish tank set up on Dad's side. Adds a nice little charm to the room, doesn't it? Kind of calm, cool, collective feeling. But there's something wrong with the tank. It's got a little disease. So we're taking TLC care with it. That fish right there, you see him? He's got disease on his eye. He's going to be the next one to go. Aww. See that guy? He's got it. He's got it. See his eyeball, bro? He's got Popeye. Ick is the disease. The scientific term is Ichylus caboculus homologulus. And what it actually does is it puts little white spots on the fish, and it actually suffocates the fish. And what we're doing is trying to unsuffocate them. But it ain't working because they're dying. Then what's going to happen to my dogfish? No, look, he's just cruising right there. Look, but he don't he look too healthy. No, I don't want my dogfish to die. That's the coolest fish we got. Look at him, man. He's sick. Dude, the fish are sick. Yeah. Unbelievable. We're losing them. See the dogfish? He's like hurting. He won't even eat no more. The puffer won't eat, bro. He won't. He hasn't eaten in three days. Yeah, they can go without eating for like a long time. Can he? Yeah. Everyone keeps feeding him, so there's extra shrimp in there. Yeah, that's not good. To be in the yeah, yeah, Dad, I feed the fish. Don't feed him. Well, I try to make the puffer eat. It seems as like he's looking for food, so that's a good sign. There he goes. He's looking at it. Oh, get it, get it, get it. Get it. There goes. Oh, dude, you're hand feeding it. What does that feel like? This is like a nudge. Yeah. That's cool. <laughs> yeah, look at him eat that. So I think right now he's kind of on the weak side. So I just medicated the tank again, and so maybe he'll, he'll get strength back in him. Fish are looking healthy. Very nice. He's really healthy. Look at him. Yeah, he wants to fight. What's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? He knows who feeds him, don't you, buddy? OK, it's time to go to work. What do we got? Remember Leo Souza? Well, Leo got out of jail yesterday. What are you talking about? Leo Souza. Well, I thought he, I thought we're off. No, remember when we His house got raided on Monday? Yeah. Right? Well, we never dropped the bond. Baby Lisa? Yes? You got that bug shot? How much was that bond? For a lot. It's 20 grand or something. 20 grand slipped through the cracks? That's amazing. OK, we're going to get him. Good. Fights back on. OK, everybody, come here. All right, so get ready for Sousa again. Several arrests. We will not take this guy out in his own house, OK? What's his charges? Promotion of a dangerous drug in the third degree and then drug paraphernalia. What's the address? Ahuni Manu. Where is that? Kahalu. Kahalu. One is the mother's house, his house is in the back. Yeah. yeah. Kill that light, Lisa, on that side. OK, let's zoom in on it. Look at them trees it's in right there. I think it's all of this right here, just that piece of land. So this is the back house, right? That's what I'm thinking. So if this is the back house, we got a cover down in here. Dang, look how big that property is. Yeah, that's huge. Remember, when you make that turn onto Kahalu, all the people from Kahalu live right there. Yeah. So everybody knows you're there. So we just got to get out there and set up a truck where we can spot him and spy on him. Hopefully, he comes out to dump the trash, something. We'll take him right then. We're not taking this guy in his house, I'm telling you. Yeah. He's a runner. He's a hider. There's weeds, bushes behind his house. If he gets behind the house, you know, it's going to be a hell of a chase. That's right. We're just going to spook him out. All right, so let's suit up right here then and go. Let's boogie, let's go. This guy's 
what we call in Hawaii a chronic. They get hooked on drugs, you know, they do good for two or three months, and they go back to jail. Leo's a convicted felon. We have to be very careful. You hear the expression, if you get that guy in a corner, watch out. Leo's not that kind of guy. If you get Leo in the open, watch out. Let's go, Beth. OK, ready? Come on, guys. Let's say a prayer right now. Lord, thank you for this day. Bless us as we go out after Leo Souza. May no one get hurt. May Leo be in jail. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. OK, let's mount up. Don't let's do it. Today we're going after Leo Souza for the second time this week. You know, he's a dangerous guy. This is a dangerous criminal. You know, he's just out of control right now, so we have to go out there and pick him up. We're almost there. It'll be on your left hand side. Okay, let's look at it first, Beth. Watch for him in a car or anywhere from right here on. 10 4. Is that him? Is that our guy? No, I didn't have Chronic, though. Sam Pierre Chronic Dow. That's a lookout that just passed you. 10 4. He's, he's paddling like hell with Susan's house. Watch. This is going to be right here on the left. 10-4. Ready, Dwayne Lane? Yeah, ready. This is his house. Let's just park and then walk up here real cool and see if he's at home. Leo! Lane, you're watching the house, right? 10 4. Leo! See the guy standing up there. These are people all that can see his house and tell him what's happening. Okay, spread out. We'll start talking to neighbors, okay? Uh, neighbors. That guy. You seen him? I know that guy. I don't know personally, but they come come more, more in the evening. Where's Leo at? Uh, Where is he? Uh, You're sure, brah. Yeah, okay. Who's that running right there? See that? Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? Who the f is that? You see him bad? You see him bad? It's not him. Bada. Let me talk to you, eh? Let me talk to you, okay? How's it? You know where Leo went? Huh? Did he leave? What car did he leave in? I don't know. I never see him. You gonna give me your word that you ain't gonna tell him that we're here? Come, give me pinky promise that you won't tell. Promise. Look at me. Pro say, I promise. I promise. All right. Now that's a promise, pa. Okay. Well, all the neighbors are driving by, you see him? That means they all think he's home, too. See that guy leaving right there fast? All them people could warn him. All right, let's call the girlfriend. Okay, Beth, let's call the co-signer now. 10-4. Hello? Michelin. Yeah? Hey, it's Beth. So what happened with Leo? Where is he now? He should be home. Call right now. See if you find him. You, okay. you got my number? Yeah. Okay. He could do anything. Hide anywhere here. See, it's all jungle back there. If he wanted to run, he freaking run for miles. He could be up in the bushes. He could be anywhere in the mountains. He don't have too many neighbors, you know, especially when you look up there. It's just all open fields and land and whatnot. So this location where his house is at, Seems like a great place to hide. OK, here's the chick, man. Hello? Hi, Beth. How's it? OK, he just called me. He had a bit Oh, I'm telling you, he's at a place where he's watching you folks. OK, 
Okay, here's the check, ma'am. Hello? Hi, Beth. How's it? Lena, get around the back of this house. Get around the back. He's in this house right here. Come on, Sousa. Come on, Sousa, come out. You want this bond to go good, you'll come out now. Friendly. Get him on the phone. I'm trying to call Leo right now. Everyone says he can. He's on his property looking at us. Leo. Are you by your property or what? Well, five minutes, call me back. What's he saying? All right. Says he's at work. Says he's got to talk to his boss. All his tools are out and everything right now. He's all the way in some country. Said it'd take him 30 minutes to get here if he left right now. He's lying. I want to believe Leo, but we can't. He might be up there. He might be at the neighbors. He might be here. But he told me he'll be here in 30 minutes. OK, here's Leo. Leo. Where, where you stay? I'm on my way. No, I never sent you out. You can talk to me and then. I mean, you have to take me to the house. No, no, we can, we can fix this, dude. We can fix this here and everything. No, there's no problem. You didn't tell me to take me in. I'm talking to you. Put those things on the side. I can call my girl and help. All right, so you're going to be here. What are you driving? Yeah. Uh, yeah, he's running now. Leo, what he's thinking, dude? He's just freaking tweaked off his mind. I mean, he don't. Imagine getting raged by the police, spending three days in jail, and then your bondsman come in the next day wanting to get you, you know what I mean? He's all kinds of things going through his head. And you can tell by his voice that he's freaking a little, little lit up here and there. So listen, let's dig out that way and have Dwayne Lee keep tricking him back to the house. Let's go. Like we're all leaving, so all these people can see us leaving, OK? Yeah. Because if he drives by and sees us, he ain't never going to stop. Now it's the pull over and wait. In position. 10 4. Okay, here's Leo. Hello? Hey. Yeah. Yeah, it's Leo. Um, I'm, I'm on my way. How long are you going to take you to get here? I should be here within 25 minutes. All right. All right. Okay, Beth, he just called, said he's on his way 20 to 30 minutes. He's coming right now. No, because I think he just seen that we all left over. Sure. So the guy's not coming. I don't want to jinx him or say negative things, but the guy's not coming. He would have been here by now. OK, I'm calling him again. OK, 25 minutes, where you at? Oh, no, this is 25 minutes, all, but I mean, I'll be there in like about five minutes, but I mean, I still got to get out of here that long. Five minutes? No, I said I'll be there in 50, 20 minutes, and it's only been about like eight minutes so far. You said it was 25 minutes. But anyway, I'll be there in about five minutes, man. OK, bro, hurry now. Uh, he's, no, he's getting all scared now. OK, he just called. He's scared to death, so we're trying to talk him in. Hold on. Four. Where is Leo? Where's he stay? Boy, where's he stay? Right up Kahalu School. He's up Kahalu School? Yeah. What do you think, Mom? You think he's at the school? Yeah. Anything, Beth? So this gal just came by with some kids, and they basically are saying, he could be up here at Kahalu Elementary School. The kid gave me directions. We're going to go check it out. 10-4. Is. That's not him. He's wasting time on this. Now we're just spinning wheels. Yeah, where you stay now? Uh, I'm over to uh, Google Ranch. So how far away is that uh, from your house? I'll be there in like about 
Right Hold on. All right, okay, because I got to get home, Leo, so hurry, let's do this. All right. Okay, he says he'll be here in five minutes, over. This is ridiculous. <sighs> the guy is not coming. Leo, you coming? Yeah, sure, sure. Bottom line, I'm like, I could be there in 10 seconds. All right. I want to on the street. Are you taking me in? I mean, right. can no, I talk if you to don't him right now? Hold on. Yeah. Listen, you better, f listen, Leo, this is dog. Up, dog? You, you can see this, that's right. I am not, okay, listen, I am right now, okay, if you shut up where I can, I will. I'm right now driving the one that's at the church right to your house. You be there in five minutes or you run like hell. That's it, I'm hanging up. Five minutes at your house, now. Hang up on him, let's go. He can see us wherever he's at. Okay, you guys stay right there. He just challenged us. So he knows where you're at, and he knows where I'm at at the church. So I told him, you show up at your house right now, punk, or you run till hell freezes over. He ain't coming. I am hot. There ain't no way he's coming. There's no right way to talk to these guys on meth. You know, you could tell him, anything. Your mother died. She's on fire running. I'm going to come tell you. I mean, they're like nuts. All right. As you can see, we're in your driveway. Where you at? Um, I'm here in my driveway. So, you lying to me? Are you taking me in? I mean, no, I'm not out. lying to you. I need Leo. We got to talk about some Now get your here right now. I'm tired of playing these damn games. All right. Well, then I'm not with you either. I'm not with you. Hey. I'm, I'm giving you the answer right here. Here we are. Get over here. We're in the driveway. We're in the driveway. We're in the driveway. Call him again. Say we're pulling your body. You don't come in five minutes, you son of a Talk to him. Yeah, where are you, Leo? Now, I'm sitting here waiting five minutes. Okay, we're waiting for you on your property. Leo, if you don't come in five minutes, I am going to revoke your dang bond, and you're done. You don't show up in five minutes, you better run to Mexico. You got that? Now! Now! Come now, Beth, up here. Ten four. Call him again, Dwayne Lee. You just gotta stay on. You can't have common sense with him. You gotta stay on that phone and keep him talking, keep him, and he's gonna mess up to where he's at or something. Leo. Okay, I'll be there. I'm coming. I said I'm coming. I, 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 I asked you guys, I went first time anyway because I just said, okay. How long? Okay, right. but, but I turned around and there's a little more traffic. I'm right by McDonald's, uh, Temple Valley. I'm gonna be there in a minute or so. Okay, so let's go now. Okay, big right now. Come, come, come. This freaking guy is me around. I'm done playing the game. So we have to catch this guy quick, and I hope to God he goes down easy, because if not, he's got some problems. You see the guy anywhere? Up there, is that him? Yeah, yeah. Eyes open, everybody. Taking one step ahead at a time. Not looking back at what's left behind. Addicted to an existence left. Self-destructive, mindless bliss. Take what you've got to hide. I feel it's deep inside. Running a skin alive. Take a breath and step aside. Coming up here at this point, I left. Keep watching. Okay, stop. That's him right there. There he is in the white shirt. Okay, hey, he's here, you guys. Let's get him. There he is, right there. Where? See him right there? On uh -huh. the white shirt? That's him. See how he's sitting in the back? Yeah, I see him. Right there, right? Yeah. Come on. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Look out. Move. Get out of the way. Watch out. Get over here right now. Come on. Come on. Now. Right here. Come on. What's your name? Excuse me, honey. What's your name? 
Excuse me. What's your name? Excuse me. What's your name? Get out of the way. Get again, sir. Lisa, bring the car over here. Leland, search him good. <laughs> really good, really good. You got anything on you, Leo? I don't. Okay. I can even work. work. I can even work with my girls. I was showered. Yeah, come here. Yeah, what's up? Come on, come on, come on. Keep moving it, please, Missy. Please, please. Really good, Leland. I don't believe this, man. This money right here. Put it back Thank you. Thank you, sir. Yeah, we got your hands. Let me see your hands. Open them up. Oh, my hey, hey, what's, what's in your what's system? What do you got? I'm meth on so you? Weed, weed, no. No, no meth no. at all. Huh? At least two months ago. No, come hey, on. I go to work every day. I got to stop it. Whatever, come on. Whatever. Whatever. OK, get in. <laughs> Seat belt. I just talked the other day. You just told me to come in. I work. Hey, come on, man. You guys ready? Jump into my house. I built that house, man. I pay my mortgage every time. I never miss. I work. No, but what happened? Yeah, I mean, what I'm happened? an addict, y'all. So I'm listen, an addict. Listen, I mean, listen. But I still live for Leo, hey. Leo, Leo, what hey. happened Tuesday hey. and you didn't call me? What happened? You didn't call and me. And nothing Tuesday. happened. Because you were in jail Tuesday. But you gotta let me know when I oh, do. Yeah, you man. gotta, bro. You, you, you don't know that. You've been in the system hey, for how many I'm years and you don't know that? I mean, everybody. Knows. I don't look for you Why every time. This? Let's go. Yeah, Leland, this is gonna be a problem. You gotta go over there with your dad. Put him in front. You know your height tweaking like Not even. Yes, you are, Leo. Yeah, hey, we, yeah. All, we all got a. Well, you, no, we all don't got that. We all don't you got that. You asked me not to say a word. They found a pipe outside of my house, outside beyond the porch by the what? picnic table area. That had nothing in it that some anybody could have cast. Me, I try to stay away from it. I fall into it once in a while, but hey, that's it. Yeah, whatever. OK, let's go. How long have you been smoking that I suppose, actually, not that much. At 26 years old, I started. I'm 41 now, but I did 12 years in prison. So, I mean, I'm not on any kind of bond. Well, I'm on a bond, but I'm innocent to proven guilty. It's America, you know what I mean? I'm a bond. I'm not I'm not convicted. I'm not on probation or parole. They raided my place, and they found a pipe in my yard. You can find more than one pipe in my yard. They think I'm trafficking? How? They don't find There's nothing there. There's just a bunch of homeless people coming up and down. Can we take a shower? Can we use your stove? They come. Tweaking, bro, you're tweaking. Whatever. Listen, when he's not like this, is he My like, mouth is sensible? dry because I ate two bites of my burger. I was so yeah. hungry from working all day. I didn't even have yeah. lunch. Is and it I, sensible I, better? All I want, I'm giving you who you're I am. You're rambling, saying, Leo. Yeah, Susan. All right, I'm rambling. You've never been to rehab, really, right? Dude, what is want? rehab? Rehab is every day's rehab, man. You know what I mean? I know. I, I've, right. been, I've been to prison for years, and I, I didn't do drugs. How come you did 12 years? For what? All my Correct. charges were car-related. Uh, you know, stolen. Stolen cars, stolen parts. I mean, I, I, I'm a certified mechanic. Any I'm guilty. I played no violence. No, he's probably he's no violence, no drugs, all that. Well, I don't sell dope, man. I don't do no trafficking. You guys out of your mind. If I was trafficking, man, I'd be pimping right now. I'm struggling. I don't know any buddy pimping that's no, trafficking. No, pimping. Meth. Is, I mean, doing good. No, I, I mean, don't. I don't know any oh, guys on. that are selling meth that come are on. doing good. Oh. Listen, then let's go <laughs> get them. Let's get you out and go take them all down. Never. Why? Because they don't do nothing wrong. Well, they just but kill children. No, not, well, we all kill, kill, kill children. If you're gonna, if you're gonna pinpoint that kind of crime on a drug dealer, then you can pinpoint it on just about anybody. Okay. Methamphetamine is a drug I'm, that kills, and you know I'm it. A it agent. ruins I'm lives completely. It does. And that's it does. that's the guys it that he's taken it out. It does. Bottom line, it does. But it also is part of us. You cool, dog? But I feel I feel disrespected. You're not disrespected hey, I mean, it's at the all. Think do, do it to others. You're, you're not disrespected at all. Yeah, when I told you to come out nice, you're like, no. I was eating. I was hungry. So I worked what? all day. I'm cool with the boonies. I, I had water and some crackers, man. I'm hungry as hell. I figure if I'm going down, I'm going to eat me a double quarter pound of cheese. Drink this. I'm on the inside, so you see I can't run. I, I made myself on the inside. From where I'm at, come on. come. You could have came in with all your, but you know what I mean? I got me a clean shirt, and now I'm here to face what a man got to face. You know? But all right, all that's right. all. Is there a McDonald's on the way here? Hey, Daddy. Oh, man, that'd be cool, man. Yeah, stop at a McDonald's. Yeah.
Drop him at golf like getting a quarter pounder at a Pepsi. We're gonna buy him more food now? 10-4 on the McDonald's. Lisa Ray, you gotta show compassion once the game is over and you catch him. <laughs> what do you want me to get a quarter pounder? Single quarter pounder with a coke. Quarter pounder with a coke. Are you hungry, Lily? Thank you, I appreciate that. Leo, want one apple pie? Yeah, that'd be good. Thank you. Yeah. Looks like he's won him over, which I'm glad for because I don't like him to go, you know, to jail all pissed off and, you know, rage and like that, you know. It's much better when they understand that they have to go to jail. So, you know, it's a good thing for us to feed them before they go so we know that they can eat. You can't be this hyper like this. That ain't natural. What are you talking about? You can't be like that. I just got bum rushed in McDonald's. Oh, stop. <laughs> and you think I'm going to be here like, oh, cool, man. Hey, yeah, so yeah, you should be. No, I'm not. I'm, I st oh, sir. Uh, I'm sorry. Is this the car that ordered the quarter pounders? Where's the roller skates? Huh? Yeah. Where's the roller skates, he said. Hey, what a, extra cheese. And Leo's extra oh, cheese. Leo. We need napkins, babe. Well, then here's some pie, a pie for you, brother. He wants Leo. the pie. I got your pie, Leo, when you're All going. right, great, thanks. Can I have another straw, too? There you go. I'd really like to know you when you weren't tweaking. I mean, you can say you're not and all that, but I would like to get to know you without that. It'd be my honor. It'd be my honor, too. I wish you would just stop the mess. You just stop it. That's what I wish. But I is it worth it? To, you know what I mean? It's, just, it's 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 own creature, man. It's for me the way I was where I was raised and where I lived. If I was to quit that, it'd be such a drastic change. You know? And I wish I could. I pray every day I could. One thing that I know about my honey is that he was going to feel really bad about grabbing him in the middle of that burger. So I'm not surprised that we ended up back at the same burger joint, feeding the guy the same meal that he wanted before he was going to jail. Let's dig out, Beth. OK, here we are. Do you smoke? No. If you get on his side and stay in the car, I'll give you a cigarette. Stay in now. Tell Leo's a player. Did 12 years of hard time, in and out of prison. Leo knows what's going on, you know? But my dad, he was in prison too, so he knows exactly how to handle guys like that. Put him in check, and I mean, looks like they made friends, so it was all right. In the criminal world, he's a decent guy. Is he ready for the free world, rules, regulations? Thou shalt not steal. No, he's not ready for that. Yeah, the kind belt ones with one in custody, discharge of sureties. Yes, discharge of surety, male yep. or female? It's a male, Leo Souza. He's a chronic drug user, absolutely. You know, he has to have his drugs to be able to function. He's not going to change his habits because someone threatens to put him in jail. got hope for everybody because he's been there and done that. There you go. There you go. All right. Good. No, you look really good. You look, you look good. And Leo, he came in, filled out his paperwork for the second time. So what if we would, if, if as long as you're good, go to court on the dates, that we gave you a letter that said, we believe that he doesn't need to do any time. Let's go right straight from the courtroom to rehab. Or do you yeah. want to do yeah, six I mean, months? That, that would help. No, that would help. I mean, I've done enough time. I don't, it's not going to Yeah, that anymore, ain't going to help. I mean, nothing's really going to help me unless I want to do it myself. You know, it's got to come from me, bottom line. You know, I got to make the, up the decision. Right. And I probably need a little wake-up call and get back on track and we'll take it one day at a time. This is honest. Right. Just a sickness, that's all. Sorry. Yeah, but you're going to get well. Yeah. He needed a wake-up call. <laughs> but he now knows there's another side of life, and he could get there. Hey, thanks for all the help, man. I appreciate it. So I'm very glad.